Okay, so here I just have the default starter template from Tailwind. It just includes some meta tags and the script for the CDN. First, I just want to begin with the title. So h1 sign up for my newsletter. There. So it doesn't look good, so let's add some styling to this. We can begin by adding some font size. So text dash 4XL and LG text 6XL. So 4XL will be for small devices like this, but if I make the screen larger, the font is bigger. Great. I also set the font to be bold, so font bold. Great. Um, I want the text for this to be white, so that will mean that when I set this to be white, it will not show up anymore. So let's have a div around this one. Div class bg gray 700 which is the background color for the newsletter row and close it at the end there so if I refresh now you can see it again perfect um in here i want another div and i want to center this here on the middle of the screen when the screen is large so div class max w 4xl which will limit the width, but it will not set this to be centered. So if I refresh, you won't see any difference. But if I set MX auto, we set the margin left and right to be auto, and we will now get it on the middle of the screen. Great. Below this title, I want the subtitle, which can be in a paragraph. So just let some random information there. Great. This does not look good, so we need to add some styling to this as well. So text white and text LG and on larger devices, LG text XL. So the way that these are working is that this will target all devices. But if you add this, then for larger and up, it will use this class instead of this class. Great. The text in here, I want this to be center as well, so now it's centered on the screen. And I think we also need some space in here, above and below this one. So inside this div, we can say py12. So now we have a lot of space above and below this one. I think we also have some space between these two. So below the h1, we can say mb6, lg, mb12. So on larger device there are a lot of air, but on smaller there is a little bit less. Great. So that should be the title and the subtitle. Below here I want to have a form, so I can just put it right below here. Form. And in here I want an input, type email. And set the placeholder for this to be your email. Oops. Your email email address and next to this a button submit that does not look good so let's add some styling to this class py4 and px6 already that looks a little bit better i can copy this class and paste it for the button so PY is above and below, PX is on the sides. The button should also have a BG Sky 700 and a text white. So the background is now Sky 700 and the text is white. Also set the font to be bold so it looks a little bit better. And I want both of these to have rounded corners, so rounded dash XL. You can also add a simple hover effect on this button. So uh, hover colon bg sky 900 so it becomes darker when you hover it and if we add a transition class then you can see that we get a little transition effect so it doesn't switch out at immediately and um, there's also need some space between these two so on the form here we can say class um, mt-6 like that so now it's starting to look good. Let's see what this looks like on a mobile phone. So open up the inspector and click the thing there. 
and if I make this screen very small you can see that this jumps on the screen be uh, line below which is okay but then we need some space between these so on both of these we can say MY2 so we have some space above and below this so there you have it a very simple newsletter sign up functionality and uh, last thing I want to do is some spacing in here as you can see there are no space on the sides here so let's just add that we can have it on this one px-6 refresh and now nothing will touch the sides no matter what size you have on the screen